Yo, what's up? It's your boy JQ back with another video. I know it's been some time, been a minute, but um, I thought I'd come out and show you is um this queen I got from she's from Australia. Um, I had one before, I had Kong even passed, but I bet that she passed away. Um, Ho Kong passed away. I pretty much long story, but anyway, I got another queen and um she has a brew and um I was I got her on December two thousand twenty three. And um, yeah, so I, I was excited to get her. She was a little expensive to get, but I really wanted one badly and happy to have her. And um, so this queen right here, um, she has this one brew and um, just, just letting her rock, they'll, they'll do a thing, you know, left, left her by a heat, heat cable, have her in this little, have this little setup. It's a small, um, some small, small nest kit I had. I have a year that just worked very well for me. I have a bunch of them. Something I started off um, with years ago, my first nests I had. And um, so I've been feeding them mealworms, um, tiny crickets. But mostly mealworms, but those tiny crickets be dying. Or if I get like a, if I buy like the, the regular size crickets, I'll just, I'll just cut it open, cut them in half. But, um, but yeah, so she, she, this video right here, she just, um, she had a drone, so I was really worried about it. I was like, dang, I got a dub, and this ain't looking good from my experience. She might be a dub queen. I dropped a lot of money on her, so I was like, ah, man. So I was really, like, kind of nervous about the situation, but but I gave her some time, and then I was hoping she'd just come back and get some eggs and see how she does. And, yeah, I think it's going to be a couple of weeks later, a week later, and, um, it's hard to tell. She still sees this drone moving around, but she has eggs inside in this video. And um, I was hoping I could get Boo Boos or, but the guy I got my last Boo Boos, sadly his girlfriend killed his whole colony in with roast spray, so he lost his colony. So I was screwed from that. So um, I got lucky. Um, this is it was like a couple of weeks ago, two thousand twenty-four. I think April. That's not I me. Mean, I mean March this is in March. So. A guy that I buy a book all the time, he had a, a colony, and I asked him, yo, you think um, I get some brew, and he sent me brew, and pretty much blessed it and kind of saved my ass here, so I was excited to get these um brew from his from queen, because the fact that she was still alive, I was still hoping she wasn't a dub, and she was furrow, because my experience that he died quick, they weak, and stuff like that, so I was really hoping that the drone were made with her, or maybe she wasn't ready made, I don't know. But she has some eggs inside, which I don't know if you could tell, it's kind of hard to see from this angle. But with the brew I boost I got, I was excited to even get that, because I got lucky, because we happened to be talking about, he said he had a colony that he said he was keeping, and I was, I was all like, oh shoot, I was like, yeah, I got a situation, I told him the situation, he pretty much sent me some brew and a couple of workers, and pretty much saved my ass, so I definitely appreciate it, you know? Um, but I'll definitely put a shout out and you know, it's a name tag un underneath this. Um, but anyway, long story short, um, glad to even um, I'm glad I'm lucky to even get this. So hopefully this this will help her out. Um, get going, get some care of her own workers, and hopefully she does well after this. And hopefully the eggs that she got um, um becomes on um, workers, not drones. So fingers crossed. Hope for the best here, but. I'm really hoping this colony does well, and this is a colony I want to have in my channel, and you know, for the rest of the year, years going, whatever the case is, and yeah, I had with 30 colonies in the past, and now that I'm a couple years into, into the hobby, you know, I know what I want to keep, what I don't want to keep, and I definitely don't want 30 colonies, like, oh, 100 colonies I had in the past, just too much work, feeding, cleaning, all this stuff, so this is a species that I'm really excited to keep and have for long term, because most of them climb glass. They're very dirty after what they get dirty ants, make a mess, but they don't climb glass, so that's a plus. And it's super easy to care for. So this is a colony I definitely want to see grow in the channel. And um by the by the way, um I don't know if y'all know this little kit I made. It's kinda like a what Kushi um nest kit. But I made it myself. I took one of those um those little tar heel um heat um tar heel um outworlds that he used. But it wasn't a tar out where I pretty much made from scratch. I bought I bought it online somewhere and um and I bought a whole book on them and um and I made this one to sample. 
It didn't come out as best as I want. It didn't come out as the way I like it, but I didn't have time to make more. So this is what I have to do for now until I make more. But um, I like it because it's, it's, it's plastic. They can't climb. They can't climb the plastic. And um, I went with this because I wanted to buy the Bakushi cell, but I didn't want to spend the money. And um, maybe one day. But the only thing I like about the Bakushi is that it's all plastic and they could climb all that. And I, I wanted something like this that actually was better for me. So. I think it's better than Rikushi because you don't got to worry about the glass climbing. But obviously, the Rikushi one has way, you know, it's way nicer and way built for it, you know. This is kind of bootleg, but it worked, did the job, and I like it. And I plan to make um, more like this in the future, probably hopefully better. And I'm making little subs like this as we, as we speak here and there. And, um, and yeah. So happy you have a happy you have a queen, happily has his brew and um really excited for the future for this colony. Hopefully they do they do really well. But um yeah guys, I've been gone for a while. I made I haven't made a video in a long time, like four or five months now and um I haven't been consistent in my recording. I've been busy personal stuff, just taking care of that right now and um and doing what I gotta do in personal life. But um I'm not I'm I'm not from um, Gone from the in, in, in game and in community. I'm still keeping ends, um, mostly selling in to make a profit. But um, these I'm gonna keep. Um, you know, I have a little business I got going that, you know, I have a little in sales here and there. I sell little colonies and I make little nest kits, blah, blah blah. But by the way, this is the workers that came with the brew booze. Um, I wasn't gonna let them die, so I gave them a little sell up. Gave them some water and um, I put a little honey inside, which they probably ate already. But um, later on, I, I just I just put some um I put some nectar inside for them and gave them a little test tube. And but as I checked a couple of days, they're still not well, so I don't know. They're probably gonna die soon. But try to care for the two workers as best as possible. They're pretty cool, pretty they're, they're very nice. So didn't want them to die from thirst. And stuff. So I gave them a little food for last a little bit and um. Back here, it's been a couple, just a couple of weeks later after after boost, and it was a big success. The queen took all the the brew that was there, and um, she accepted it. And um, there goes a drone. I don't know, probably she's probably, I don't know if the drone was helping her or nothing like that, but the male drone, but he's just there. So I know later in the worker, later, later in the video, one of the workers does hatch. But um, this video was just made at the long ago, so we see what happens in the future. But um, yeah, I guess for the rest of the video, I just play some music and um, yeah, y'all enjoy the video, watch the video, and um, I like what you see, comment, like, subscribe, really appreciate. It. And um, if you definitely want to see me make more content like this and more videos, just put a comment down below, down below and I'll definitely do that. And um, yeah, I'm gonna try to make more content for y'all make videos here and there and um not 100 back but i'm gonna try to make content here and there just for, just for the hobby but hopefully I'll, I'll at least make one video a week or but most definitely definitely a video a month but we'll see where we go i can't promise you anything but i'll definitely have some content if y'all want to see that put a comment down below see what y'all want to stay underneath and um thank you for love thank you for the respect and um yeah enjoy the video peace
don't know if you guys know, I do some of my own nectar. I got green apple, hawk, I got blueberry, orange nectar, pineapple um, nectar, strawberry um nectar. And I just came out with cotton candy, kind of like the um, Aunt Lady's cotton candy. It's pretty much the same thing. Um, I figured out the recipe. I forgot how to do it. Um, if y'all want to buy this um, Instagram down below. Thanks. Mm -hmm.